The herb is, is still going. To, it's still going to. A, it's well, a again, we, we 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 right. When we look at it, we we're putting public money in public facilities that are failing our children, and we need to stop doing that. It's not the facility we should be putting the money. In. We should be putting the money in the children. I mean, we should be putting money in, in in the effective way in which children are being taught. And we have to get away from that. We have to get away from, you know, like, uh, is it really going to uh, uh, church institution, for instance, and uh, to say the least. Uh, is that fair? Well, what's fair is that it's going to people who are part of our society. And we are responsible for taking care of society, not the structure. Um, I'm, I'm a very high uh, advocate for uh, education that people may want to uh, use technology, you know, uh, online education. That's people who can get a degree sitting in their home, uh, whether or not it's a church. Doesn't really matter to me. I wasn't saying the churches as a religious well, institution. Well, religious could institution. be a mosque. It could be a, a temple. It could be well, a I mean, like we, call, I call, I call a mosque a church. You know, I call a Jehovah okay. Witness Semantic. institution. You know, but the fact of the matter, what we're really getting at here, is is it appropriate to uh, in, invest in facilities that have the ability to perform? without the control of organized labor. And I believe that that is important. I think it's necessary. Interesting you say that because obviously coming from organize, organized labor, we, we and, and also I, I might respectfully, I do respectfully disagree in terms of the control. I, I don't think the NGAA, which has become the favorite whipping boy of, of the governor, uh, controls the educational system. But we can argue that another day. Mm -hmm. 